All right, so today we got the Crossman Vigilante. How this pistol works, obviously it's a revolver, hammer, and you can pull it back, obviously, it's a revolver, or you can do double action. And there's a button here on the top, and here's your rotary magazine. Okay, now I'm going to show you that this thing runs on CO2, and I'm going to show you how you put the CO2 in it and how it runs. All right. So basically, CO2, you just pop the hands right off. Get the CO2 cartridge here. Anything thing will open. And uh, basically, you just gotta put it right in there. Just, little, just twist it. You hear the air puncture, I usually twist it a little bit more. Pop the handle back on. And push down on this. Take this out. Rotary magazine. And make sure that these little ridges right here are what you what you're looking at. Put the pellet in like this. Round those pellets. Fit in there pretty snug. Cross them by the way. Cross pin too. Pin picking up. But basically, that's what it's going to look like to you, only with all of them. And when you put it back to the gun. Remember to still face these ridges and put it on this little notch. And uh, I usually just close it like this because this is metal right here. It's real metal, it's not aluminum. Magnet sticks to it. Some people like to push down on it, then close it, but that's just how I like to do it. All right, now let's see how uh, this thing shoots. You get to see this thing's uh, not very wimpy. All right, so one more thing before we uh, get to shooting here is that where the safety is on this gun is pretty interesting and very easy to know when your safety's on or off. Pull the hammer back. Now I can fire it. See the red dot right there? Not sure if you can see it. And now I can't fire it. See? Okay, now let's get to shooting. Let me get the uh, right belt here. Bring it off safe. Got two two liters down there full up, filled up with water. Got the top sticking off of them. And I got a sh uh, sharp tip pointed pellet in here made by Crossman. So, let's see how it shoots. Alright, looks like it didn't get to the second one. Let's go down there and see how it looks. Alright, so this is where it entered it. Pretty good hole right there, actually. There's some paper in there. I'm not sure if you can see it. And our second bottle. It looks like it might have hit it right there, actually. I'm not. No. So, pellet probably still in there. I don't see no exit. One, two liter. Can't go through. Alright, now let's get some fun. Let's get some fun done and maybe a bit of accuracy. Alright, so we're going to make the accuracy test a bit, a little bit quick here, but it definitely did not go out the back of that two liter because I got the pellet back. Alright. Got my GoPro rolling down there. I'm going to try my hardest to aim for the O on the cola, the word cola, the O. We're at 50 feet here. All right, so we're gonna try one more time with this accuracy test. Got the GoPro rolling again. Instead of 50 feet, I cut it in half to 25 feet. Gotta aim for that O again. Well, actually, I don't think that was a pillow. That one kind of missed. Hit. Yes. Got it. More. No. All right. 
now let's actually get to the fun part of the shooting. Alright, so now let's get to the actual entertaining part and the fun part for me. And one thing I forgot to tell you all guys about, I got some new glasses. Just put them on here. Alright, tight fit. Reason I have these, they serve two purposes. They're dark so they can serve as sunglasses and they're safety glasses. So, let's uh, get some soda bottles here. Got my GoPro right over there so y'all can witness some slow mo. It's all of them run that pretty quick. Something about a revolver just makes you want to pull the hammer back. That was all of them. It's got a 10 round rotary magazine. Now let's move on to something a bit more fun than just shooting uh, two liters. Alright, so now we got some soda cans. Now this should look a bit cooler and just one more thing, I promise, last thing I'm going to say. I'm not entirely sure I had the GoPro rolling when I just shot those 10 balls that I just punched on the ground just a second ago. And uh, I'm not lying, I literally decided to punch them. But I guess I'll find out when I go to editing. Got some crossman sharp tip pellets in here. Got a problem. Sorry for the inconvenience here, but I could have swore I heard that CO2 canister. Okay, now what's the problem? Okay, I could have swore I heard that CO2 canister release some air, but okay, now sorry for the inconvenience, but here we go. Raised him. Okay, so basically this thing's just made for plinking. You want me to get those two last cans, don't you? Alright. Please comment, rate, and subscribe if you want to see more can shooting and some slow-mo from the GoPro. It rhymes. But thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.